Hi guys, it's Cindy. Welcome to my channel. On today's video, we're gonna go ahead and do a clean with me. My house is a mess. I have a three-year-old. He destroys the house and then when he takes a nap, it's my time to kind of clean it up a little bit. I did take off the carpet in our living room to pressure wash it because it was dirty from just like people wearing their shoes and just like everyday use. So I am going to have to put that back and then it is kind of gloomy today so I did put an inflatable like jumping thing for my son so if you see that in like the little sitting area it's because it's gloomy out and I wanted to get him distracted because we can't really be out today. So let's jump into this video. Let's go ahead and clean this house. Let's get motivated together. Just play this video and start your own cleaning routine. I hope this inspires you a little bit or if you feel like just sitting on the couch and doing nothing, go ahead and do that as well. I just realized that I had all those bags of baby wipes. I don't know why we had so many, but I definitely need to downsize them. Also, I'm gonna show you right now and that cup that I'm gonna bring up right now. My son puts his toy in it and I just thought it was hilarious how I could have probably choked. Alright guys, so I start wiping down the table and I noticed inside the grooves there was like a lot of crumbs. So I attempted to clean it and then I got lazy after the third one. So definitely the señoras would be very disappointed in me. Guys, by the way, this isn't my dog, this is my sister's dog, but I just thought it was so funny how she's just living her best life. And I'm over there struggling, sweating, having a whole workout, and she's just patiently waiting me for me to finish putting this rug out. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I really wanted to give up at this point. I was just waiting for my husband to get home, but I told myself I'm almost done, so I just kept pushing through. Alright guys, so my son had cereal on this table and it was just really dirty. So I had to go pull out the big guns and bring out the scrubber and try to scrub out that dry cereal. I'm not gonna lie, it took me a couple scrubs. And you'll see in one of these clips, like I had to wipe it off and do another scrub again. And it didn't get the job done until I used my nail. are enjoying the 
clean with me portion of the video but i went to tj maxx so i thought i would share what i bought yesterday tj maxx marshall's ross those are like the stores you go and you always get in trouble because you buy more than you need that was definitely me this yesterday and i bought things that i thought i needed but i could have been fine without it but let's let me just share what i got first and foremost you cannot go to the store without looking at the clothes especially for my son he outgrows his clothes so fast and um fall's coming winter's coming and it's cold here where i live so i found this little cute nike set for 25 dollars at tj maxx it's like a little beige and olive sweatpants and I thought it was just like cute, comfortable and still like aesthetically pleasing looking. Um, he's four, I mean he's three, not that he cares. Also, my husband got these packet snack Tupperware things. Um, I don't know what he needs them for because he needed them. All right, I'm kind of thirsty. <laughs> I've been cleaning. And I'm thirsty. Okay. Moving on to the next thing. Oh, since I'm doing a cleaning video, my husband found this at TJ Maxx. It's a gas range cleaner and degreaser, and it's heavy duty what we need in this household. Um, and it was $4.29. So I'm gonna actually use it on this video and I'll let you guys know my thoughts on this cleaner. We bought sleeping gummies because I buy these. Sometimes I have a hard time going to sleep and I like to take these, but I buy them at Target and they're about 15 to $20. I can't recall how much they were. So I found these for $6.99 and I definitely grabbed one because I think this is half the price at Target. And then my husband got some socks on clearance. Look at him, clearance shopping for $8. I've been teaching him well. Another thing, I found this cute little condiment um, set for like ketchup mayo and this is good for like my husband's lunch. And then I also bought this kitchen vegetable chopper because We've been cutting up green pepper and onion and putting us putting it into our veggies, you know, trying to be a little bit healthy. But girl, we don't have time to be doing that, okay? So we go the lazy route or the smart way, some people may say it, and we bought one of these. So I'm hoping I use it enough that I bought it and it's gonna occupy space in one of my cabinets. So I'm hoping I use it enough to justify the purchase. So this was $16.99. Is it too soon? Please tell me it's not too soon. This is the first week of August and we already got our first pumpkin candle. Oh, it smells so good. I don't know why I smelled it. I purchased it because I like the smell, but I had to smell it again. And we got this one for $10. And I kind of want to light it up because you know when you clean and you light up the candle at the end, it's just so satisfying. And I don't know if I should burn it yet. I'm kind of on the fence. So I'll see. I'll let you guys know at the end of the video if I burn an old candle or burn this one. Maybe I'll save it for actually fall. All right. So now that I made more of a mess for myself, then let's get back to the cleaning video. I was definitely jamming out to Bad Bunny. Is there like a specific artist or music you guys like to listen to while you guys clean? Let me know down below.
in the words of my son yuck i don't even know what this is to be honest but i definitely needed to take them off and put them in the washer Guys, by the way, this cleaner is amazing. You're gonna see right now in one of the clips, like I did scrub it, but with that wipe down, it got a lot of the grease off that I wasn't able to get off with a regular cleaner. It did say to let it sit there for like 30 minutes, but I don't have time for that. So I just went ahead and wiped it. I mean, it did an amazing job. Okay, the way the towels are being hung, like not centered to each other, is really driving me crazy right now. Alright guys, I hope you guys are enjoying the video. And the last thing on my to-do list is mopping the floors. I did go ahead and vacuum with the Dyson off camera. Maybe I got a clip of it, maybe I didn't. But now, the last thing I have to do is mop. And then we're going to turn on the candle and we're officially done with our cleaning. Guys, I'm over here trying to become this aesthetically pleasing influencer and look at the curtain pole hanging for its dear life. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this clean with me today. Um, I am going to do more videos in the future more DIYs cleaning um, 
mom life and plenty of more things so if you like this type of content go ahead and subscribe and welcome to my channel i really appreciate anybody that subscribes or even leaves a little heart comment down below just to support me on my future videos thank you